Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It is your girl Shanika Marie and we are back with another video. Y'all, I just wanted to come on um, just to tell you a word from God that I heard this morning and I believe that it's going to help you too. So this morning I found myself, um, while I was up just, I had some, some quiet time. Well, I was about to start quiet time this morning, but I couldn't decide if I wanted to read a Bible plan, listen to a sermon, listen to a podcast. I was just scrolling through all of the things trying to find quote unquote, something to do um, for quiet time. And I really just heard God say, how about you be still? Be still. And I'm like, okay, well, I do. I need something to like feel myself, you know, so I'm like, can start the day, you know, like what you talking about, basically. <laughs> but you know what? Um, this morning, um, I was like, when I heard be still, like I was still, I like I literally cut everything that I was about to turn on. I closed the Bible app. I closed everything. And I was like, okay, Lord, okay, you want me to be still. And so um, I just opened my journal and I was just still. I didn't have anything on, no background noise or anything. And God just revealed to me like how... It's so easy for us to go to a sermon or go to a podcast or even, you know, um, go to a Bible plan or something for just to look for answers. But sometimes the next answer that we are looking for, but not even the next answer, the answer that we're looking for is through stillness. We will get that answer by being still with God. And I know I'm the type of person I always like something to go be going in the background for me to listen to, whether it's a podcast or music or whatever. But I really feel like in this season, God is telling me to be still. And when that means be still, quiet the noise. And this morning, like I, that was like my first time doing quiet time like that in a while. Like I've done it before, but it's been a while. Um, but I literally just sat in silence and I did open my Bible and I was just went through a few scriptures. Um, me and my therapist had talked about um, last week, but I literally started my quiet time off with just silence and I just worked on breathing. I just allowed God to kind of minister minister to me. And that's when he told me, like, you, you look for your answers in these things. Yes, sometimes that stuff is good. Don't get me wrong. But in this season, your answer is going to come directly from me and while being still with just me and you. And so I just want to encourage you today, if you are waiting on God for an answer in this season, it may not come from a podcast. It may not come from a sermon. It may not come from a Bible plan. It's going to come from you sitting still and being with God in this season. Turn off the noise. Turn off the people's opinions. Turn off the music. Turn off whatever you need to turn off so that you can be with God and he can give you that revelation that you're looking for. And so, um, yeah, I just felt led to share that with someone because this is the season. I mean, it's going to be challenging because I am a person who likes, you know, to listen to different things, especially like personal development and different sermons or whatever. But even though it's a challenge, I'm still going to do it because God told me to do it and I'm going to be obedient. So I don't believe that you're watching this for a reason. I mean, for no reason at all. I believe you're watching this for a reason. And God wants you to know that answer that you're looking for, you're going to find it in the stillness. You're trying to figure out like how you're going to write that book. Sis, he going to give you the strategy to write that book by being still. You're trying to figure out, well, how am I going to grow this business? How am I going to go after my dreams? You're going to hear that answer straight from God in your stillness. Okay. So I pray and I encourage, I, I, not encourage, I pray that this is for you and if it is let me know in the comments and let me know also what, what are you waiting to hear from god i know for me in this season and i'm completely honest i will i want to and i know i am i am going to write some type of devotional before the end of this year and also too um so i want to do that and um also with just like life coaching and trying to figure out what i want that to look like because i'm actually thinking about maybe doing some group coaching and I feel like I have like a ton of ideas, but I don't actually know how it's all going to work out. And I don't know how to like structure it. So in this season, that's something that I'm kind of praying for, um, just for clarity on and Also just balance with life, y'all. Life can be a lot, y'all, just um, with me working and kind of getting back into the rhythm of working and um, being a new wife and just 
everyday life in general, it's a lot. So I'm also just praying for God to help me just balance some things out because I've been feeling a little bit out of rhythm, but I know, you know, sometimes that's okay, but I'm just asking God in this season for just direction and, um, just not strategy, but just asking him to help me in this season to, you know, do life well and to show up in the areas that he has called me to show up. So yeah, let me know in the comments if this is for you. Thank you so much for listening and I'll talk to you in the next video. Peace.